Good morning, friends, and welcome back. So this morning, we heard this beeping sound while we were in the bedroom and couldn't figure out what it was, so we came outside to investigate. And I have to show you what we found. Come on along. All right, guys, so our egg layers. We have about 16 egg layers, and over the last couple days, we've only been getting four to five eggs. And so we were thinking, like, maybe it's their time. Are they about to molt? Maybe the move threw them off, we're not quite sure. But until this morning, we were concerned. Now I know why. We found a whole clutch of eggs down here. And there's at least at least four different uh, chickens that are laying down there because we have four different color eggs that I can see. I'm about to pull them out and see how many eggs we found and then take them inside and see if we can do the uh, water test to see if they're good or bad. Before I go put, put my hand down there, I am going to go get um, a little stick just to kind of move things around because there are snakes in our area and our neighbor just caught a rattler a couple days ago on his property which is just behind ours so definitely have to be careful before i go sticking my hand down there so let me go get a stick loud noise is all you need to do and they usually get scared and they'll go away all right i don't see anything hear anything So we've got two, four, six, eight, ten, eleven eggs here. And a couple days ago, I did find an egg on the sidewalk over here. And I just thought one of the ladies just got scared and dropped it right there. But I'm thinking one of the dogs already knew about this. And they came and they got it and they put it over there. So let's go inside and see about the water bath. All right, friends, so we are here. I've got the eggs. I've got cold tap water. So what we're going to do is we're going to place the eggs in there. If the eggs sink to the bottom and they lay flat, they're good. If they either raise to the top or if they stand up, then that means air has gotten into them and they are bad. So let's see. That one is definitely a good egg. You can see it's laying flat, it's not floating. Egg number two. Same thing. Alright guys, also a tip, um, when you are storing your eggs, it's always best to store them pointy side down. And this helps prevent any uh, bacteria from coming up to the yolk as well as if you choose to store them at room temperature you can do that for a couple weeks but you have to make sure you do not wash them you just take them straight from the hen house and lay them in a, a container like i have here and you can store them on your counter for up to two weeks if you wash your eggs you need to put them right back into the refrigerator or put them into the refrigerator because you have removed that protect protective coating that's on it and bacteria will definitely be able to get into the egg at that point and they will start going bad. So I always just put my eggs in the refrigerator anyhow just to prevent any kind of issues from happening. And I usually go through my eggs within a few days anyhow. All right, last egg. And that one is good. All right, just as a reminder, guys, you can store these safely um, two weeks on the counter. It does say you can store them longer. Um, I wouldn't go past the two weeks just to, for safety reasons. So definitely do two weeks or just stick them in the refrigerator just to be safe. But uh, I can't thank you guys enough for coming by the homestead today and our quick little video about our hens. I hope all is well, and I hope you have a blessed day. Mm -hmm.